Hey, is this thing on? Because my name is Philip, the Flying Chillip, and I have returned from my grand journey. You see, Philip, it actually isn't on. It's completely turned off right now. Ah, oh, fuck. Whoever farted is gonna die. Yeah, I'm, Zach I'm, did it! I'm, I was just kidding. It's, it's on. I know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, I will have you guys know that I finally did it. First, my little journey. I was a zombie for a while. I wouldn't stop saying it. But I didn't want to annoy anybody. So I went on a journey to resurrect myself. And you know what? I failed horribly and I died. But thankfully, I came back as a ghost of a zombie. Which is how I came here today. Philip, who the hell are these people on screen? Oh, yes. I have finally did it, people. Wait, I wait, 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 wait. People is that giants. Is that Chris Chan? Ah, fuck. Oh. We're not supposed to be in this match, Chris Chan. I no, no. He, no, he, he's a woman now. You gotta respect that. Oh, I'm sorry. This is Christina Chan. I'm sorry. Oh, so got you weren't invited to this match, Christina. Guys, it's supposed guys, to be Cousin Mel. Does this mean the first ever wrestler... Does this mean that Chris Chan is the first wrestler in history to be both a male superstar and a diva? Actually, there was one before him. Santino Morella and Santina Morella. Which was Santino and Drag. Or his long-lost you know twin sister, okay. I'm sorry. Second in history. Here. Well, you know what? First is the person who have made this match Cousin Mel. Now, it is written in her contract that if she is going to be in a match, it has to always be in her specialty match. You see that cage above you guys? Or should I say cell? Oh, so Guess what it's called. So it's a Hell in a Cell match? Better. This is a Mel in a Cell match. Bye! Have a good time! All right, now I'm going to take over the headsets. Let me just get it. Oh, hey, look, somebody has returned. Thanks for returning to your job. Glad How you was your break? Did you enjoy your life? Probably not. I really hate you. It's a good thing the crocodile's gotten his way. Anyway. And I thought my jokes were bad. Ah, oh, fuck, it's the Joker. Current see, AWS Unlimited Tag Team Champion. You see, I was uh, feeling very proud. Hey, of the fact you know what, Joker? I, uh... I'm going to have to have you wait a little bit, because my girl, Noir. Haru, the queen of foreheads, the next champion is here. You see, I, I would agree with you there, but you see, I, I like, I don't like giant foreheads that much. I mean, that's, that's what makes her powerful. Big. That's too big for me, though. She what? She would not have psychic powers without that forehead. Okay, do, you do not disrespect got, my religion. Do I know how I got this forehead? How did you get it? How'd you get it? I was born with an even bigger forehead, and uh, my father. Uh, Actually, uh, he, he just thought it looked weird, so he had me get plastic surgery, and now I have a normal size forehead. You're probably, you probably probably would have killed Batman by now if he would have let you kept your normal forehead. Ah, oh, fuck! No, my goal is to have him either kill me or, um, you see, uh, my goal wasn't to kill Batman. He, I, he's too much fun for me, and what the oh, hell I'm sorry. am I looking at? That is, a uh, Christina Weston Chandler, who I did not even invite to this match. She just showed up and put herself in this match. You should not be here, Christina. I no, did not. Ah. Uh, oh. Do I, you guys want to know how I got these scars? From that, seeing that. From the horn on her head. You see, Christina actually assaulted me outside, and uh. Oh. Yeah. I thought you were gonna tell me you had an interesting bed experience with that. You probably did. That's the, the rape thing's probably cover up. You know. uh... Yeah. I agree. I'm not gonna get into my personal life right now. I'm just too darn happy about. <gasps> my championship I won uh, last episode. Well, you know what? You're nothing compared to the Pancake Posse, who will also be defending their tag team title next episode. Now, and here comes Marge the Simpsons. Now that right there is a woman. <sighs> well, you might want to be careful though, Joker. Last time she appeared, she actually ripped out an audience member's tongue and added it to her collection. That's my kind of woman right there. I don't know what you're talking about. You like She's your also tongue taken. being removed from your body and fed back to you? Look at my clown makeup, sir. Do I look at the type of person who would who would uh, reject that? Your cousin looks I like understand. you wouldn't have a plan. I got scars that form a smile on my fucking face. Okay. Oh. 
Because so I would feel? totally be into that. Mm-hmm. Tell me yeah, how you feel. But that, huh? there is one other little wow. consequence there, Joker. What? You also what would have... This? Oh, this a is belt. the Chaos Women's Championship. Very American, I don't know. Is it loads like a computer? Now, Fuck yeah! Why are we having two championship matches twice in a row? Well, I happened to plan my women's match at the same time he planned his tag tag match. You just so happened to plan it right after, Zach. This is actually one of the few times where I did not rip him off. Because I'm not ripping you off till next episode of Chaos, where we have a tag title match. Ripping me off? I didn't plan these matches. I'm not Zach. Or ripped off Whatever. Was, I you meant to tell like, you through like, Zach. You know, I like it when you I actually like it when you go out of character because it causes more chaos. Oh, you should have been here last episode. I'm an agent of chaos. You As should join my show. It's literally called Chaos. And I am an agent of chaos. You know, exactly. I, I'm a free agent. Nobody owns me. You know what? I could book you in a match with Homer to see who could get with Marge. Oh, now I never met this Homer person. What does he look like? Yeah. Is he the reason Zack Thunder, you and Zack Thunder are afraid to go out at night? Here, here's a picture of him. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, he's a gorilla, man. Oh, no. Oh, and your people are probably wondering. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I legit just shat myself just now from looking at that. <laughs> oh, dude, you nasty. I got my fucking ass kicked by Batman. I can't believe I it took us till now to finally do a poop joke. Like, that is an impressive amount of wait time. Why haven't we done one? Why haven't you done one yet on AWS yet? Because I need to tell these people this the difference between Hell in a Cell and Mel in a Cell. That, so, yeah. Well, you know what? You want to know the difference between a Hell in a Cell and a Mel in a Cell? What's the difference? I, I really want to hear this. A Mel in a Cell is like a Hell in a Cell, but it has Cousin Mel in it. From My Grandma Got Ran Over by a Reindeer. You ever seen that movie, Captain? Yes, I have, comrade. Yes. This is the main villain from and that, that movie. Quote. Grandma got run over by, by a reindeer. reindeer. Walking home on, on uh, one night during Christmas Eve. Eve. You can you say, say there's no such no thing as Santa. Santa. But as, as for me, Captain Communist, me and Joker, we Joker. believe. And I pulled the flag chill up. And I went up to our sound top. Alright, guys, we need to start singing songs together. Everybody, we start singing All Star by Smash Mouth. Alright, oh, wait, three. Before, before we do that, no, wait, wait, I, I need to throw in a conspiracy real quick. Okay, right, first get your conspiracy, conspiracy theory. Here's my, here's my conspiracy. Fine. It's how I got my scars. Uh, you already told us how you got, got your scars. Oh no, wait, it's relevant, it's relevant. You yeah, you got Bye. beaten up by some kinky girl, and then no, next no, no, thing no, you no, know, no, you no, had no. a slash from each, from your lips all the way up to your ears, sir. You were PD. into that. You see, Santa ran over my grandmother. Uh, actually, my conspiracy connects to that. He laughed when, as he did it. Ho, ho, ho. I didn't... Grandma didn't like that. Not one... Bit. So... Well, I bet. My grandma... Actually, that's it. I didn't really get scars from that. It was just a really weird day for me. But... I actually have a new uh, conspiracy for you. Just another day in the life of a filler. Just another day in the life of a chill. Just another day in the life of Joker and Captain as we explain the Jonathan Testicles conspiracy for us. And today's uh, you know, Johnny Testicle conspiracy. You know that Take it away, Philip. He ran over Grandma. Johnny Test ran over Grandma. Jonathan Testicles ran over Grandma. You see, uh, whenever I got my scars that day, it was actually from his spiky, fiery haircut. Is the John and in backpack? Jimmy John's stands for Johnny Test? You know, uh, that restaurant... We've never seen Johnny and Jimmy in the same room. You know, that restaurant being run by, uh, some 13-year-old who only cares about himself really actually kind of makes sense. But way to get political, Joker. That's not political. I'm talking shit on the restaurant. That has nothing to do with politics. Well, you know what? The Queen of Foreheads is so powerful, she is battling the voodoo witch, March Simpson. Did okay? she just punch my future baby mother? No, she face. need her in the face. Difference. The punch would be her signature move well, on the women's right. Well, you know what? Christina is more powerful because she just threw her like a goddamn wreck. She's just making this interesting, okay? My girl will prevail, okay? She... They call her Noir because she's sneaky. It's not about being sneaky. It's about being obvious. Sh showing yourself. 
So it's about Don't sending hide a message. Where you are. It's about sending a message. You're you just salty because it's that. Batman. You... Philip, look at me. Look at me! I am looking at you. I just really wanted to quote another line from The Dark Knight. That's really all the reason you know I what? said that. You know what? Next, whenever, you're fighting Homer. Not even for Marge's affection. It's just because I'm mad at you. For invading my show. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Yeah. How do you like that? Captain? Or, oh, wait. Captain's taking a leak in the bushes. Oh, I don't like that. Not one bit. Hey, Captain, you might want to watch your dog near the water. There are alligators sitting hey, there. Hey, shut oh! up! I pee out vodka over here! Alleg oh, Captain, there's a crocodile coming right for your jaw. Oh! Hey, you get your butt and your bastard teeth off me, cock! <laughs> As Joker has a stroke in, laugh. as Joker has a stroke, my girl slammed her cooch on Marge Simpson. That's a lot of power. I'm not biased, you're biased. Something about cooches and power. Yeah, she slammed her cooch on Marge's head. Holy shit, Cousin Mel. You know, I feel like showing a scene from Christina Weston Chandler's um, famous comic book series that has to do with cooches and power. Here it is. Ooh. Oh, Amy Rose, uh, use that to your advantage. No, no, no. That's, um, that's Sonic Chu's girlfriend. Totally uh, different yes, character, Rose even though... Oh, yeah, Rose yeah. Chu, that's right. I'm even sorry. Even they look exactly the same, but... How could I confuse these two very different characters that have nothing to do with each other? You don't know how? Because your mind is the size of a pebble. Hey, by the way, Captain, how's your pee, -pee doing? That's He's just doing weird. just fine. Don't oh, good, you got... It's, it's healing up well? Yes. Thank you Why so much Why are you hard? Asking. I'm not, mate. You can take a look right now. I can't really get hard after a freaking crocodile done beat me cock off. Ooh. I don't know, you look pretty into it. I mean, now I could shove me whole fist in myself. Now, whereas I couldn't do that before where it was physically not possible, but now I could be next level trans. Because instead of just having an inside out one, I just gotta just beat the fuck off. It's you know, you kind of sound like Shrek. It's bigger than Batman. How do Wait, you what? know? A croc just ate my cock! Well, I, I can see the croc eating your cock. Yeah? You over into that? There. I can get him back over here. You know, I might... No, well. you don't I mean, really need to, Shrek, a promise. Somebody once told, told me the world was gonna rule me! I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed! No, my love. I, she I should do it like this. Somebody once told me the world was gonna show me I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. She was looking kind of dumb with her finger in her thumb in the shape of an L on her forehead. Upside down L if you wanted Waluigi. Well, they don't stop coming. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Yeah, I mean, we probably already got copyright struck at this point. If it makes you feel better, I don't stop coming. Ah, oh, my woman, yes. She's one Well, man. I mean, you kind of got a problem there. Oh. First you, first of all, you got to put it in to stop. You know what? At least Christina Chandler got pinned, so everybody else got protected, which is good. As Marge Simpson. By my woman, is the too. First, I'm very proud of her, you know. You know what? She's scary, so I say she's earned it. Our first Chaos Women's winner and first Chaos Women's champion. What does that mean for the future of my division? I don't know. I'm like WWE, I don't plan ahead for anything. Horrible things, I'm sure. Or like AEW, where I barely ever use my women. I'm taking a shot at all the companies today. Um, Impact has a woman as a world champion, so I can't really shit on them. Uh, um, We need something really dumb and stupid to end this episode off. Mick fucking kill yourselves! The machine's Mick broken! You know, that's not nice.